God our Father, we give you thanks and praise for fathers young and old. We pray for young fathers newly embracing their vocation. May they find courage and perseverance to balance work, family and faith in joy and sacrifice. We pray for fathers around the world whose children are lost or suffering. May they know that the God of compassion walks with them in their sorrow. We pray for men who are not fathers, but still mentor and guide with fatherly love and advice. We remember fathers, grandfathers, and great-grandfathers who are no longer with us, but who live forever in our memory and nourish us with their love. Amen. Happy Father's Day to all the fathers and significant adult males out there. And my father passed away a number of years ago, yet I still feel his love and his legacy are very close to me. His love of the outdoors, his love of reading, the love of his family. And now, having three boys myself, I feel very privileged to be able to pass those same things on to them. Happy Father's Day, guys. Firstly, Father's Day for me is a day to reminisce and think about my old man. He's taught me a lot in life from my faith, the value of hard work, as you can see, he's a farmer, and also honesty. Happy Father's Day, Dad. I just wanted to say thank you so much for all that you've ever done, teaching me, loving me, supporting me, guiding me, always being there, and most importantly, not disowning me when I decided to become a Collingwood supporter. I know it's your biggest regret in life. Happy Father's Day, go Pies. My favorite memories of Dad go back to when I was younger, and Dad's a builder, so, I remember when I was younger, Dad would often take me on uh, on job sites and he'd often put me in the wheelbarrow and he'd push me around in the wheelbarrow. To my dad, a very happy Father's Day to you, Dad. I miss you, wish we could see you, but thank you for all the love and guidance you've given us over the years. I've always enjoyed all your corny dad jokes. Um, keep them coming, Dad. Love you, Dad. And another strong memory I have of Dad is I remember I was 14 and we were playing cricket together and I was out there batting with Dad and spent a lot of time batting with Dad in this innings and we put on a really good partnership and I was out there the day Dad batted through the entire day, the entire, entire innings to hold his bat and made 100 and that was really special to experience that with Dad as well. Uh, favourite memory of my father? Um, I don't really particularly have one favourite memory of my father but I know, you know, as growing up, uh, you know, my father and I spent a lot of time together with cricket. Cricket was a big part in our family. I know we spent a lot of time, you know, Dad coached me a lot in cricket, so when I was young and, and I know, you know, I have a lot of memories of that, you know, winning grand finals with Dad and celebrating with them, so I think that, that's, you know, one of the memories I remember most about growing up with Dad. Dad, thank you for being the most amazing father. I am very proud of the man that you became. I will always treasure our time together, whether it be while we're traveling overseas or whether it's sitting down having a chat. Happy Father's Day, you are forever in our hearts. I'm proud of my father because he had such a positive influence on my life. He was always encouraging me to get out of my comfort zone and support me in whatever I wanted to do as well as my three other brothers and sister. I'm really proud of you know what he's done. He's, he's still there as that um, support person for me in my life too, like to talk to him about things that I need to. Happy Father's Day everyone. Hope you have a fantastic day to all the fathers, grandfathers and great grandfathers out there. What am I proud about of my own father? Probably giving the opportunity for me to grow as a person, being someone to always confide in and seek advice from. I want to wish uh, all those dads out there and special men in our lives a happy Father's Day and especially uh, to all those who are dearly departed. And what do I enjoy a bit most about spending time with my dad probably is when we get to go fishing on the Glenelg River and just us, no technology, no one else around, just the two of us spending time together and hopefully the opportunity to catch a big Malloy. So have a fantastic day everyone. Happy Father's Day to my husband Mick, to my dad who's poppy to his grandkids and to my grandfather Pa or Papa to his great grandkids who's 88 and still doing amazingly well. We're planning his 100th birthday, not long to go now, Pa. Happy Father's Day to you, happy Father's Day to Dad and to Mick. And for all the dads out there, happy Father's Day. We love you and we appreciate you. Happy Father's Day 2020. 
Um, especially a big shout out to my husband and my own dad. I hope your day is really special. And to my husband, Matt, happy Father's Day to you. Thank you for being a wonderful dad to our three girls. We love you. Happy Father's Day, Matty. For me, myself, Father's Day is obviously about my kids. Um, enjoy my kids and having fun with my kids and watching them through all stages of their life, uh, which is so rewarding for myself. What about back in bed? Oh, that's right. And breakfast in bed's a winner. As a dad, what does Father's Day mean to me? It means spending time with Lockie and Zoe and <laughs> celebrating the fact that yeah, yeah. my influence and positive you know, relationship with these two are going to help them grow up to be good kids hopefully and sort of reflecting on you know what I learned from my father as I grew up with him and how he was a positive influence on me so I'm hoping that will turn out you know, and reflect on these two. So what does Father's Day mean to me? It means getting extra special gifts like a pair of socks with your baby and also your dog on them. So I'm really excited to see what Max brings to the party this time around. Uh, what does it mean to me about being a dad? It's getting to spend time with your little man and seeing him grow and also getting the opportunity to see him smile. Um, that's some pretty special moments. What's the special things I enjoy or a special part of being a father? Um, is celebrating you know, the special things with these two. You know, celebrating birthdays, celebrating special occasions, but also you know, making sure you know, celebrate those little milestones as they're growing up. My bike! Yes, like riding your bike. That's my right. What's the most special part about being a father? Uh, for me, it's about what my kids think of me. I know for a fact that they think that I am the coolest person in their lives. Very, very funny. Um, very good at cooking and a smart dresser. All those things that I know that makes them feel like they're the most special kids in the world. Isn't that true, boys? That, that, that is not always true, Dad, but we still love you anyway. Uh, okay, thank you. My favorite memory as a father, um, besides you know, being there for the birth of my two children, probably you know, being there for their first steps, I think. That was always something exciting when they took their first steps, but um, also just you know seeing them achieve you know little milestones as they grow up, and I'm looking forward to seeing how my two kids turn out as as they grow. Wishing all fathers, grandfathers, and male carers a very happy Father's Day. I love being a father, and I love particularly now being a grandfather of my four beautiful grandchildren. Being a father is a very important role in the modern day family dynamic. I think there's a lot of parallels between fatherhood and teaching. There's a lot of respect to be gained and given. Certainly in our household there's a liberal amount of cheekiness with uh, five boys. We've celebrated the successes and we've taken the opportunity to learn from those not so successful times. Uh, there's lots of laughter, lots of good humour, but above all it's unconditional devotion to the job at hand. Some of my best memories of being a father is back in the day when the kids were little, our Friday night ritual would be going to the video shop, remember those, and perusing the shelves and finally picking one that suited everybody. Then on the way home, we'd pick up our fish and chips. We'd get home and all snuggle up on the couch under our blankets and watch the family video together. Uh, one final thing, one thing that dads can do that no one else can do uh, is tell dad jokes. Thank you. Happy Father's Day again. Happy Father's Day, everybody.
Father's day. Have a great day. Like your heavenly father, I see love in my father's eyes. Happy Father's Day, Dad. Thank you for being the kind, caring and funny person you are. I know this Father's Day might not be like the rest, but I hope you still have a great day. Happy Father's Day, Dad, and I'm excited to be spending the day with you. delicious meals and for taking me to footy games. Happy Father's Day. I love you, Dad. I see God in my Father's eyes. Happy Father's Day. I love you, Dad, and thank you so much for everything. the fathers, grandfathers and mentors out there. I'd like to thank my dad for his advice and his unique sense of humour. <laughs> I'd like to wish everyone a happy Father's Day on Sunday. Similar to our Mother's Day earlier in the year, we are not able to join together in our extended families this weekend to celebrate and acknowledge our fathers and the special men in our lives. We encourage you, however, to reach out in the many different ways you can to wish your father, grandfather, or special men in your lives a very happy Father's Day. To me, being a father is one of the most important and rewarding roles and experiences that I could ever imagine or hope for. Watching my children grow from babies to little people and then now to have my oldest as a teenager. Time certainly flies, but it is exciting to see what a new day brings, what new things they have learned, and how they grow into their own individual person. Growing up, my dad played such an important part in my life, and I hope I have grown into his values and display the qualities that he gave me to my children. I've got a photo here of my dad, Kaylin, my eldest son, and myself cutting wood out of the farm from a few years back. It may seem quite insignificant, but to me, it's those special times that we are together that I truly value. I hope that I can speak on behalf of all students when I say this to our fathers and special men. Dad, for bestowing love on me, for being kind and caring, for making me inspired, and for filling my life with happiness, peace, and love. I'm grateful to you for guiding me to reach new heights and all your words that gave me a perspective which no books can teach me. Whilst we can't join together as a Damascus community to celebrate Mass and enjoy breakfast like we have done in the past, our thoughts and prayers are with each and every family as they celebrate Father's Day. To all our students, take time this Father's Day to show your love and appreciation for your father or special men in your lives for all that they do, their guidance, their support, their love, and their encouragement. Start having a think about how you can make this Father's Day a special one for you and your family. In closing, I'd like to thank all students and staff that have contributed to the beautiful messages on this video, as well as the lovely performance of the song, Through the Eyes of My Father, with Tristan Clonan on piano and sung by Hanny Muirhead. Thank you also to Sarah Boswell, and Jamison Thomas for the production of this video. Stay safe everyone and be good to your father. Happy